What's going on everyone and this time let's take a look at the iPad and more specifically how you can manage YouTube videos and how you can add, edit and delete a thumbnail of your YouTube video right from the iPad. It's very simple but you should definitely know the correct way to do it. So as you know and as you are like a regular person you probably have the YouTube regular app downloaded on your iPad. It's the one where you watch all of your content. It's good, nothing wrong with that. But to manage your YouTube channel, to manage your videos, it's best to download the YouTube Studio app. It's uh, the place where you can see your analytics and all the places where, like, all the things that apply to your YouTube channel. So make sure to download it and, like, set it up with your Google account to have everything ready. And if you want to change and upload or whatever you do with your thumbnail, you're going to have to do it through the YouTube Studio app. It's, yeah, it's probably the only method, and even if not, it's the best method. So definitely use this application. And the way to add a thumbnail is very simple. So you go to the content section at the bottom. You can see like the tab bar of all the things, like all the sections, go to the content, and you can see like a bunch of different videos. So you can either like open the video up and then click on the edit button, or without even opening it up, you can tap on the three dots and like click edit video right there. But you basically get to this section. You can see like the analytics, you can change the description or whatever you want. But at the top, you can see the picture. So you need to tap on it and you will be moved on to like a section where you can choose a different thumbnail. If you already have one uploaded, you're going to be able to download it to your photos. So that's good in case you want to like get, uh, grab and get your old thumbnails. But if not, you have the regular three options that you can pick from because it's great. You can choose like three um, moments from the video that are going to be like your thumbnail. Or what most people are going to be able to do is to click on the change button. And this is going to get you to the photos of your iPad. So this is literally just move you over to your uh, gallery and there you can pick from any thumbnail that you want. However, what I need to say, and it's kind of important, well, you need to have like the correct size and dimensions of the photo. You want to make sure that the thumbnail size is actually a valid one. You don't want to put there like a square image because it's really like not an ideal you just have to look it up and just check out how big the thumbnail should be. And yeah, you should create a good one. Of course, there are so many ways how you can create a nice thumbnails. But this pretty much means when you're already like uploading it, we are like kind of assume that you already have one created. So yeah, I just wanted to save that. But anyways, once you do that, just save the video, save the changes, and you are basically good to go. The thumbnail has been uploaded, you, it has been changed if you wanted to, or you could even like remove it or grab it to like download it. So that would be basically everything what I wanted to share in this video. If you enjoyed it and found it valuable, what I want you to do is to hit the thumbs up because it lets me know that you liked it. And for more content like this, make sure that you are subscribed to the Fox Tag YouTube channel. Thanks a lot for watching and I'll catch you in the future. Peace out, guys.